we expect the BEPS action plan to have a major impact on our transfer pricing and tax department. Certainly the need for um, compliance with the new measures and also uh, from a results uh, uh, point of view. Uh, BEPS has obviously put a lot more pressure on governments to collect revenues and to focus on various aspects of international tax. And for the World Bank, we've seen a lot of growth in demand from countries for technical assistance in these areas, in particular transfer pricing. So it's meant a lot more work with a lot more countries all at once. Um, hard to tell at this point in time. I think we're potentially affected less by country by country reporting than some other groups because we already do a form of that publicly. But um, uh, interested to see where the developments go over the next 12 months. I, th I think uh, country by country reporting, um, getting ready for country by country reporting, um, access to data uh, within the within the entity within the company is going to be challenging, um, and then looking at the impact of the outliers in the country by country reporting, also increased controversy over the next 12 months is going to be taking up a lot of my time, I think. The overall concept of BEPS and integrating it into our corporate decision making and policies so that we can deliver uh, within the framework but also maximising our resource utilisation and minimising our risk. Um, our intangibles and uh, the permanent establishment. So um, in connection with that, how much substance do we need to have in uh, a particular country? Dealing with all the changes anticipated through BEPS. Um, big impacts potentially on us as a group and also on all sorts of other companies, I think. So I think one of the really big aspects of transfer pricing that's going to change over the uh, coming months and years is the documentation requirement. Getting a lot more sophistication, a lot more guidance around documentation. And I think that's going to drive a lot of activity in that area for our clients. The speakers we just had from the tax authorities and the OECD, I think were really helpful. Johannes Schimmer of Adidas, um, and I like this presentation. Well, I think uh, Andrew Hickman uh, from the OECD, given his perspective on, uh, you know, coming from practice, now going into the actual BEPS process, I think he's going to be one of the key, uh, in fact, probably the most important person in transfer pricing today.